How you feel about this? It's, it's juicy. How you know? You ain't touched it. I mean, it, it look plump. What's the definition of plump? You know, it like like fat, but like supportive. So she had a threesome? Nah, my mom not a whore. I never said she was a whore. I know my dad and my stepdad. Mm -hmm. What would you call your ass? We you talk about my ass. So we talk about this? Yeah. It's a whole bit clean though, man. You know, they be big. Sometimes they just think a little bit when they be big. All right. What it do, as you know, I didn't uh, work with you before and you didn't, you know, prank my friend, but let the people know who you are. Throw what I want, real street cunt. Hmm? Throw what I want, real street cunt. When we, when we edit this video, make sure y'all put the subtitles with the balls. Cause I don't know what he's saying. You want him to put some balls and shit? No, not balls, like, oh. but the bouncing ball. Oh. Uh, so like, let us know about, matter of fact, let them know who you are. Hi, my name is Mariah Mills. And my Instagram is this is Mariah Bell. What you looking at? Huh? How you feel about this? It's it's juicy. How you know you ain't touched it? I mean, it, it look plump. What's the definition of plump? You know, it like like fat, but like supportive. Mhm. Mm what would you call your ass? We ain't talking about my ass. So, we talking about this? Yeah. It's a whole bit clean though, man. You know, they be big. Sometimes they just stink a little bit when they be big. How you feel about that? Do it stink? No, my booty is clean 24-7. 24-7? So, let's just say this. What would you name this ass? What type of car? Uh... Probably like a, uh, I give it like a 96 Ford 150. What you think about that? I never even heard of her car. You wanna look it up? Yeah, what is that? What is it again? 96 Ford 150 hatchback, it's a truck. Why well, yeah, a hatchback at the end? I mean, she got a hatchback. Would you sit on it? Hmm. I don't know. What you think about it? Is it like he is he trying to downplay it, or no. it's just like it's not it? It's not fit, it's not giving what's supposed to be giving. Yeah. Do it move? It Can you show him how to do it? And move? Can you move it? Yeah, a little bit. Can you look at me while she do that? I can't. Look at me. I'm trying to. What's so hard not to look at me and just not look at that? You got a big old ass. Right, but just we get right though, huh? You're here for me, this is for you. Uh, you know, you can do two things at one time, multitask. So you cross all that? Sometime. All right. What'd you do last night? Went to the comedy club. After that? Went to bed. What time? You ain't the police, is you? No, no. Okay. This is about you, right? This is about you. Yeah, I feel like you're nervous. Yeah, I, I'm nervous. He's different. Nah. Is this a cut? Oh, we just not. Nah, no, he just talking. Um, no, you real. You cool. We going. Yeah, yeah he just talking. You gotta say something to him. You think he's nervous? No, I'm good. You think he's nervous? Yeah. It's him. Uh, I've been seeing oh, big ass my whole life. You've been seeing big asses your whole life. Yeah. Why? Like, what makes you think this is a big ass? What if it's just normal for her? It's a normal size. Why are you calling it big? I mean, that motherfucker out there. Mm -hmm. That ain't just no, you know what I'm saying? You know, like you got some ass that they like perk, mm -hmm. but you got some on that just out there. That one of them out there ass. Is there a reason why your hat tilted like that? I'm from Atlanta. Does that wear our shit? That's how they wear it? It seems like your cap is a little bit longer than what it's supposed to be. But you got a little head? No, 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 no. I'm saying the, not your head, but the hat, is it seem like the brown? That's what you call it? The visor. Yeah, yeah. Is it longer? Or? It'd it be like that. It, it, no. Mm-hmm. So like what's on your mind at this moment? I mean Ash. What? I'm looking at one. I can't stop I can't but stop. But it's looking. about us, that's what I'm saying. Are you why are you distracted about that? That's what's wrong with people. Oh, I can't help it, man. What can you help? My children. 
So let's say this. She call you, right? Yeah. Call you at, you know, probably 3 o'clock. She wants you to stop by. She right down the street, but your son get out out of school at 3 or 5. You got to pick him up from school. Break down what you're going to do and why. I'm going to get my son first. And we're going to pull but up. But you got to know. Hold on. See? Her husband going to come home, though. You got to get there. Her husband going to be at home at 320. I'm going to bring a different outfit. I can be a lawn care worker or so. No. <laughs> <laughs> That was funny. Because I'm trying to get where you're going. So, like, I'm saying break down the story. Okay, you got 3 o'clock, right? Yeah. Your son get out of school at 3.05. Her husband is at home at 3.20. Break down. She live right down the street from you. Break down. What are you going to do? Like, you know, the time now. Like, you know. Okay. You walk out the house. What are you doing? So, 3.05. What a school is it? School. Let's say it's like seven minutes away. So, I get to my son by 3.12. And you say her house right down the street from me. How far down? Say about like three minutes. I'm gonna call my mama and tell my mom to get my son for it. <laughs> y'all hear him? Does he, I, is he kidding Are y'all feeling it? Do y'all feel like that was a good answer? Like he keeping it real? How y'all feel? Why he making you crap, bro? All right. I just uh, like, are you bullshitting us? So you gonna, you're not gonna pick your son up. You just gonna go spend a little quick time with him? It don't take that long. What do you mean? You just gotta get it in and get it out. Oh, you okay? Huh? You said a husband come on. Hold on. You like quick pumpers? Yeah. Huh? Are you a quick pumper? Just What's the pump? longest you're gonna last during sex? The, the longest? Yeah. I don't know. About like 45 minutes. How you feel about that? It's like a regular session. It's regular? I mean, I just heard if a girl, if it lasts that long, it ain't that good. The vagina. Oh, really? So I heard 45 minutes. I was on drugs. What type of drugs was you on? Adderall, alcohol, mm -hmm. weed. Can you take us down the moments when you first started popping those? With Adderall? Yeah. About 17. Mm -hmm. ADHD, couldn't focus. Take one, eyes get big, focus. Mm -hmm. And then where you go from there, what do you recommend to kids when it comes to drugs if they, you know, <clears throat> Just like they ask you, is it good to take Adderall? What do you tell the kids? Don't do it. Why? Because I'm trying to be a positive role model. How are you doing them? I did them. But you did do them. So would you tell them to try it just to let them know how it feel? Nah. Not no kids. When we speaking to kids, we talking about 21. Savage. You a kid to you? Oh, no, you just 21. I'm just saying oh. the age. I can't tell nobody 21 what to do. That's a kid. Nah, I mean, I ain't that old. Mm hmm I ain't that old. 21, that's, that's kind of like in my same generation. So, the first thing you think of, like, you know, when you look at an ass, what's the first thing that come to mind? Do it smell good? Is it real? Mm hmm You know what I'm saying? Do it got that bounce on it? Do it. Preview. Can you cuff it? Look at me. I'm trying to. Is it hard? Nah. You got on shades. How I know you looking at me? Hmm? You got on shades. How I know if you looking at me? Who said I'm supposed to be looking at you? My point is that. Right. So you do stand up, right? Yeah. What's wrong with you sitting down while you do it? It ain't standing up if you sitting down. All right. What do you got coming up? Life. In jail? Nah. Just living life. Have you ever been to jail? Couple times. What happened when you was in there? I burned it out. Who? Got on probation. Oh, what'd you do? Snuck cell phones no, in. No, no, what'd you do? You said you what? I burned it out. Can you say that slow? Burned out. Why'd you go? Racism. Y'all hear this? Yeah. No. So who you tell on? Who I tell on? Mm -hmm. Myself. I was on Instagram posting shit. What'd you post? You remember that? Yeah. I could turn 500 to 5 million. You can? 
No, nah, but I was telling them I can. So you were scamming people? I wouldn't call it scamming. What would you call it? I call it finessing. But finessing can be a good thing or a bad thing because you can finesse somebody and you can be happy and also they can be happy. So you let people unhappy, correct? No. But if you told me you could turn 5,000 into many much more, you didn't. What do you call yourself? If they believe me, it's on them. But wouldn't, shouldn't we believe you as a man? I was just making a Are general a statement. Are you a man? Grown. Grown what? Man. You hear about how do you feel about scammers? You wouldn't have a chance with her. You're a scammer. She'll help me scam. Hmm? I make her help me scam. I don't do scams. I take donations. See? Donations. Coins. Know what that mean, right? No, I don't. You ever been on POF? Wait, what? <laughs> All the females that got donations in their what's the name? They take donations. All right. So what are you doing on POF? Putting people together. What like, POF though? Plenty of fish? I know you've been on there before. <laughs> Who said I've been on there? I just never heard about it. How you know the name of it? Because I heard about it. But you just said you didn't hear about it. No, I'm just saying, I didn't mean to say that, but that's what I said. You so blind or you deaf? Huh? You blind or you deaf? Are you black or you white? In between. How you know? Caramel. Do you know your daddy? Both of them. So she had a threesome? Nah. My mom not a whore. I never said she was a whore. I know my dad and my stepdad. What do you call them, man? Pops and step pops. We say pops at the end, I mean there's more than one. Yeah, I just said I had two daddies. So you call them together, pops? Yeah, we had conference calls. Can you call someone right now on your phone and let them know that you love you? Love them just randomly? That's it, just say that and let's see what they gotta say. You want me to really call somebody to tell yeah, them I love them? Just tell them that you love them. Put them on the Let's see what they got to say. They going to think I want some. Let's see it. <laughs> Are you, do you ask people for stuff? Okay. I'm talking to you while you while you do your thing. You want me to tell my mom I love and hang up? No, just sit there. I just want you to know I love you. Okay. Yeah. I just want to tell you I love you, mom. I love you, That's it. Tell her that it. What you doing? I'm sitting right here with some blind dude doing the interview. Talking about asses. Yeah. Can I talk to her? That's her mama? Yeah, this is my mom. Can I talk to her? You want to talk to her, mama? Who is that? Some blind dude standing next to a big ass. What? Yeah. How you, you doing? How you, how you doing, man? This is we're just doing we're just doing an interview with him. Could you say three good things about your kid? I can say if you don't tell me who you is, you can get uh, my name my name is Marco. Marco? Yeah, we're just doing an interview with him and I asked him could he call What kind of interview? It's just asking him, kinda of understanding him and just just getting to know him as a person. This is like wanna go global and we just wanna know, can you name three things good about him? And what what kind of company are you? What kind of company are we? Uh, yeah, what, what, what you do? I mean, like, what's your business? For, like, what are you doing? Are you entertaining? Or, I mean, what you doing? I like, why are y'all interviewing him? Interviewing him for what? Hold on, let me call Brandy. What's the phone? What's that phone? This your mama? My real mama. What's that phone? She sounds good. Let me call Brandy and see what, what 16 she had. 16 when she had me. Huh? 16 when she had me. And how old are you now? 28. What? It ain't adding up. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Are you trying to get hung up on? I fight for free. Who is he? You fight for free? That's not nice because Mayweather make millions of dollars for fighting. You should probably rethink that. She hung up. Yeah, that's my mom. She you don't take that? no shit. I never gave her shit. You did? I gave her conversation. Is this where you get your attitude from? No. You do you have one? No. Can you tell us about the first car you ever broke in? Like, you know, just break that down. I tried to use a screwdriver, it didn't work, so I picked up a rock and bust the window. Mm -hmm. Right down up by Lennox Mall, back in the day, like 2003. And how you feel that person feel when they came out? They should never left a laptop and some change in the middle of the car. You didn't say nothing about a laptop, so you took a laptop? Yeah. What did you do with that laptop? I sold it. How much? About $300. And what did you do with that money? Bought some weed. And then did what with that weed? 
smoked it. You didn't flip it? I ain't buy that much to flip. Anything you want to tell the world? Book me. What do you like? You know, I'm very like into like, you know, I believe in like everybody gonna pass one day, right? Yeah, everybody gotta die. Right. So what do you want to leave with the real? Like knowing about you, like you know, when they come, like, cause this is once we put this out, you can always be watching. Like, what do you want people to know? Like, you know, about you. I just want them to know I love my kids. That's it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel the same way. Now I want them to know, like, I save money in my savings account. They're gonna rob you then, you can't take the money. Who gonna rob me? You don't want nobody to know that right, when you money. die that you but save some money. If you did, how are you getting robbed if you no longer here? Easy. Inheritance. If you're dead, you can't get robbed, bro. You can't get robbed. Oh, you can't. If you die, you own a house, they can break in your house and rob you. But you're not longer here. What do you feel about that? Um, I feel like your, your spirit takes care of your body. Right, so, so once you die, do you feel like... So if you die and somebody broke in your house, would you, do you feel like that's robbery? Burglary. No, because you don't really have any feelings anymore when you die and that's Well, that's my opinion. It's burglary. You wouldn't know about that, huh? No. Have you ever got hit with that charge? TMI. Hmm? TMZ? Yeah. What did TMI mean? Too much information. But if you did it past tense, and then you want to speak to the world, let them know it's not good, what's wrong with sharing the message? The world don't know me like that to that's tell them they, my that's, business. That's why you're supposed to let them know. No, I don't want to tell them what I did. It might what? be on file. So you feel like I'm getting into like too deep? Yeah. Who said somebody's important going to watch this interview? What if nobody watching? I'd it's be okay. Us. At least I was here. So she agrees with me when you get robbed. Well, if you die, you can't get she never said. She never said she agree. Hey, y'all. How do y'all feel about that? If you die, do y'all feel like y'all still can get robbed? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. But then you're not longer here. It's burglary, right? It's burglary, right? But how is it yours if you're no longer here? Burglary. You got any questions I should ask him? Like, you know, questions that you ask guys just to see? Like, what is just something that you want to know about a dude when you meet him? Just what like do you. Guys look for in a girl? What do you look for in a girl? Compatible. With sign wise? Sign wise? Not just in general. You got to be able to talk to you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Be able to disagree to disagree. So, judging her. I like, like to fuck. Huh? What? what got to have a girl that like to fuck. All girls like to have. Suck. Okay. That's what I want. So right now, judging her, would you think that she's relationship ready? I don't know. Just judging from the looks of her, would you feel like I would like her? Nah. How you feel about this answer? Um, I don't know. I don't have anything towards it. Right. Yeah. You said that because she has a nice body, right? Nah. Why? Because I don't know what y'all got going on. Who is y'all? You and her. She's on the show just like us. She came here, she's working just like you're working. You said if I wife her. Yeah. It's my best saying. friend. Oh. You might want to fuck your best friend. Who? You think it's okay to do that? Fuck your best friend? Yeah. What's wrong with that? It's wrong, right? If they're your best friend, you shouldn't be doing that. Well, most guys that say they're my friend, they always want So what about best friend? Even best friends. So do you think that's okay, though? Right. Have you fucked your best friend before? Back in the day. What was her name? TMI. Why you can't say her name? I don't want to. Why? She's not my best friend no more. Okay. Because you fucked her. Over. But what makes you different from other people? Because let's say that's, that's a great answer, right? But do you have a unique answer? Something that just fits you? Yeah. What? Just telling it like it is. Mm-hmm. This is what fits me. Are you looking at me or that? I'm looking at both of y'all. One eye on the ass, one eye on you. So you're 
So you, oh, why can't you just pay attention to me? Because that's just there. Parentheus. Right by definition. Parentheus, you get to see. Is that the right word? Yeah. Correct, no. Peripheral visual. I think I'm saying it wrong too. No, it sounds like you're saying it right. Okay. Wait, he said parentheses? Yes. No. Oh. No, what did you say? Parenta? Parenthio. I thought you said parentheses. No, he just said that. You feel like that's the right answer? No, so parenthio vision. I just forgot to say vision. You got a corn dog? You remember about what's over there? Here we go. Got Have you ever ate a corn dog? Hell yeah. <coughs> what do you feel like grown, about grown men eating sausage links? You give a damn what he eat. You gotta eat, don't you? I just said it's kind of not right for men to eat that and also bananas. You need potassium. So it's right to cut it up instead of just trying to chew it right there, right? Just don't stuff it down your jaws. Hey, what do you feel like, man, that do do that? Do you feel like that's not right? It's their business. I said, do you feel like it's not right? This is your, this your opinion. It's their business. But do you feel like it's not right? It's their business. But do you feel like it's not right? That's their business. <laughs> do you feel like it's not right? That's their business. So we had a yes or no, multiple choice question, A or B. You have to pick one or you die. Do you feel like it's not right? That's their business. Huh. I ain't watching no nigga eat. Who says you watching it? You just said it. Who's watching and seeing something that's two different things? No, it's not. You got to use your eyes to see and watch. So are you watching this? Yes. I feel like I got to know you. What's your name again? One. What's your Instagram name? Throw it off one. He water. throw it now. I, I don't know. Why though? I'm throw it off. I mean a lot, right? Yeah. Can she move it again? Or she only move it when you say move it? Who said I ever told her to move it? I heard you. Do it move? Right now it's not. She got a kind of, I don't know if it's clenched or she just, no. Yeah, I'm gonna clench right now. So you clench? <laughs> yeah. What is clench? How do you know about clenching? That's like when you're like... Yeah, like when but she just you, did that, you see I had loosened up. But how do you know? When she just standing there a little hard. Like, how do you know about yeah, that? Yeah, I rub ass, oil, shea butter. Put my elbows into it. You gotta rub that ass. You make the coochie wet. You think that's right? Um, well, rubbing asses make my coochie wet. Like fingering or... So yeah, rubbing asses is kind of like the little boys, right? That just trying to feel like that's just that's it, like more shit right? She lying. How you feel about it? No, he I said like you lying. Lady. Yeah, she like she's a woman. That's what woman like. Yeah, you smack that ass, you rub it, you grip it, you cuff it. She don't like that. That's what I'm saying. The ass ain't that far from the pussy. So if you How know, far do you go up? If you know what you're doing, you rub it. And you rub the pussy too. That's all. When was the last time you did that? About three days ago. What was her name? TMI. So you rubbing asses and you can't even tell her name. Why? Because. You trying to rub my ass too? Who said I am? Why you ask me what her name is for? Because we just want to know we want to take her. You know? Did you wash your hands? I did yesterday. Oh. I haven't done nothing today for me to wash them today. Did you rub that ass? No, I wouldn't. I respect women. I don't feel like you should just rub with my ass. You can ask her. She may give you permission. I just feel like that's rude. You gotta ask for permission. I just feel like you should. I mean, the ass that big, you know. What do you mean? I would ask. I'd be like, look, I never seen the ass that big. How big are you? Can I touch it? Everybody has a big booty. You know I'm lying. I'm just free game. (laughs) Why would you lie to her and not tell her the truth? This is where you go wrong. Who? You. I'm just saying, I had that fat. I would ask, like, no disrespect to you, but. Can I touch it? It just look like it's, it just look squishy. They like squishy stuff? Yeah. So why don't you just play with Gushers? They ain't squishy. Gushers are squishy, I believe. Yeah, they have like juice in it. They just pop when you squeeze them. It's still squishy? No. Nah. It's candy. Okay, we'll play with softballs. 
A softball ain't soft. You got a point. Well, I guess this is where we come to the road and the end, and you got something to say to like anybody that you hate? Fuck you. Why not show love? Fuck you. Show them love. I'm saying leave out with a positive message. Leave out with a positive message? Yeah. If you hate me, yes. fuck you. Okay, could you live out with a positive message? This is a positive message. Again, say it over. Fuck you. So for the people that hate you, you what would you that's not right. Like God don't do that. Like for the people that have that not that's not a right. That's not love. God's not love. I, I never was, said I don't love you. I just said fuck you. That's not right. And what's your definition of F U C K somebody? I don't fuck with you. You feel like that's cool? No. All right. Fuck him. Fuck you. See? Do you feel like that's okay just to say fuck somebody that hate him? Do you feel like he should spread more love as a black young man, knowing there's a lot of violence going on? Yeah, you should spread love. Right. It's not so hate. somebody rob you, you gonna rob them? No. Exactly. So if somebody hates you, why hate them? Somebody rob me, I'm gonna get them murdered. I work for my shit. My hey, kids. Do, right, I understand. I love. I do love. But rob is only temporary thing. You'll get it back. I've been robbed three times before. It Bless you. Okay. Bless your heart. Why? Wow. I couldn't have did it three times. It was about the same person. I just figured out how to like stop it the fourth time. Oh, you're gifted. What would you? How would you feel being robbed by the same person three times? They gotta die. <laughs> no, not necessarily. I just feel like they need love. No. Nah. You need to be put down. I'm like a dog that bites you too much. The animal patrol come and put him down. Mm -hmm. Cause they ain't learned their lesson. Before we go, what do you feel about temp service jobs? I worked a couple. How you feel about them? Bullshit. It's a scam? Yeah. What about you when you scam people? Would you call yourself a temp service? At times. Temp scammer. Hmm. On that note. You know, this is just like where we just naturally just ended. You did your part. It's kind of like history, you know. It's history for me and you. What's your name? Doesn't matter. Oh. What's your name? Right. That's what matters. I love her. You never. Like you said, spread love, yeah. not hate. Love. I love all the bitches. I ain't call her a bitch either. I'm just, I love the bitches. <laughs> I feel like you called your bitch. I so? like it. But it's okay. It was like, if so, he mean it in a respectful way. Pray Tupac said it. I ain't call her no dog. They walk on full legs. I'm just right. saying. Just, that could be a name. Yeah. They make it a bad thing. Yeah. Bitches call each other bitches. They right. just don't like what we but call you bitches. walking down the street and somebody say, hey, pussy, how do you take that? Hey, I love it. I'm up. I mean, I mean, you get up. You finish? Or, I mean, you can just stay there. It's up to you. She got to go? Huh? She do her own thing. Oh. Are you good?